He's the nurse who poisoned his patients. And today, the families of Victorino Chua's victims finally got justice. He murdered two patients, 44-year-old mum of two, Tracy Arden, and 83-year-old Derek Weaver. His sister, Linda, said she was relieved Victorino Chua is now behind bars. I think he's so evil, so evil. Yes, um, diabolical acts of... I've obviously enjoyed seeing people suffer. Tracy Arden's brother said he felt nothing for his sister's killer. I think the sentence that's been handed out by the judge today reflects, uh, whilst it won't bring any of the victims Tracy back or, or rectify anything that's been done by Victorina Tua, um, I think it recognises the gravity of the offences and also make sure that he'll never ever be able to harm anybody again in the future. This was Chua filmed on CCTV inside Stepping Hill Hospital, where he secretly contaminated saline products with insulin. He poisoned another 20 patients. Many were elderly and extremely vulnerable. Investigations by police found Chua, who trained in the Philippines, may have faked his nursing qualifications. Checks on nurses from outside the EU have now been strengthened. Inside court, the judge described Victorino Chua as dangerous and devious and sentencing him to life with a minimum of 35 years. He said he'd committed a dreadful crime and must now pay the price. He has consistently failed to show any form of emotion during this process um, and any form of remorse for what he's done. There was not a flicker of um, of emotion on his face, apart from um, what appeared to me just a general contempt for all the proceedings that were uh, ongoing. No one knows why Victorino Chua did what he did, but the families now know he can't hurt anyone else. Leila Hayes, 5 News, Manchester.